I'm Francois Ashley. Welcome back. In this whiteboard chat series, we've introduced Amplify as this open API management plane that brings together your different API platforms, your cloud platforms, your service meshes. We had a whiteboard chat on the discovery agent capabilities of Amplify. We had another whiteboard chat on the traceability agent capabilities of Amplify. And in this final whiteboard chat, we're going to look at Amplify's policy agent capabilities. A common pattern for applying policies to an existing API is to add a proxy, an API proxy or an API gateway in front of the pre-existing API. This is a very clean way of applying a new policy, but this pattern has its limits. You can't just keep adding more layers of indirection whenever you need to make a change or add a new policy. The idea behind this policy agent in Amplify is to be able to report on, but also to act on the policies that are associated to an API within its own domain without a new layer of indirection. Okay, imagine that you have an ingress API on this Istio service mesh. Now, through discovery, you will have this API show up on your Amplify API management plane. Now, Amplify has a policy agent capability for the Istio service mesh. Over on Amplify, you can assign a policy to this API and via the policy agent, this is effectively going to reconfigure the service mesh so that this policy is now enforced by the Envoy component through which the API traffic is already going through as part of the service mesh. This is the policy agent capability of Amplify on the service mesh. So you could have multiple service meshes each running their own APIs independently. And through the policy agent capability of Amplify, you can now have a centralized governance of the policies that are applied to APIs. Now, centralized governance of policies is not always the model that is appropriate. For example, let's say that you have this uh, cloud platform here. Amazon or Azure, you have APIs here. You have obviously an API gateway in your cloud provider, and this has its own policies. Maybe the way that the organization is structured, that's good. You want to have autonomous policy decisions in this particular API platform. Amplify still gives you the discovery of those APIs and this traceability, this observability of the APIs in this cloud platform. But in order to accommodate your organizational structure, you have this freedom with guardrails model, if you like, where Amplify is not changing anything about the behavior of the policies there. You can have the same thing on this API platform, but maybe it's not for the same reasons. Maybe over here, you've got obviously an API gateway here and it has its own policies. Even if you want to, from an organizational perspective, have a centralized governance of the policies, you might not be able to do this yet. The way that this API platform is implemented might require some adaptation in order to accommodate this model. So you can have a transitionary period during which governance is uh, distributed across different silos of APIs, and some of it is centralized over on Amplify. Policy agents is an area of development over at Amplify. Policy agents are available on select platforms today. And we want to continue to support this vision of freedom with guardrails 
across all of the platforms uh, that we are supporting. So look for an example for things like policy insights uh, from these different platforms over on Amplify. So this concludes the uh, whiteboard chat series on the Amplify Open API Management Plane. Now Amplify is more than this Open API Management Plane. So stay tuned for future whiteboards where we may dive deeper into some additional capabilities offered by Amplify. Thanks for watching.